thank you for joining us tonight. A woman is dead after an officer involved shooting in Lufkin. This happened last night at the Great Oaks Apartments on Old Union Road. Lufkin police responded to a call from a woman who said two men were kicking an apartment door. We do have a warning tonight. Some of the police body camera video in this story may be difficult to watch. KLTV 7's Mariela Gonzalez has the very latest. So if you hear something like that, you know, you expect something to happen. An apartment resident who asked their face not be shown told us they have lived in the complex for several months. They say they have been hearing gunshots nearby recently. When I first moved here, it was a lot calmer, but then I say about a month or so, you know, things change, you hear gunshots and stuff, so it's changed. The caller told dispatchers that the incident happened roughly five minutes earlier and that they didn't know which way the suspects had gone. The caller was told that an officer would respond to the apartment. Lufkin Police Chief David Thomas said in a released public statement, once the officer arrived at the location, a woman opened the apartment door holding a handgun and aiming at the officer. The officer fired four shots as they retreated from the armed woman. The armed woman was struck by gunfire and collapsed at the end of the staircase with the gun still within reach. According to Thomas, it was later discovered the armed woman was the same person making the initial call. He said the officer notified dispatch, followed by checking on the woman's condition and performing CPR, awaiting paramedics. The woman was taken to a nearby hospital and was pronounced dead a short time after. The apartment resident says it's a sad situation for everyone involved after learning about the incident. You know, most people just want to have a, a calm environment they can come home to. They don't have to worry about things like that. Mariela Gonzalez, KLTV 7 News. And a quick correction from our report at 5 o'clock. As you saw in the video, that police officer was in uniform. Lufkin police have not released the name of the woman killed, but do say the officer who fired the fatal shot will remain on routine administrative leave as the Texas Rangers now take over this investigation. The Lufkin Police Department declined answering questions or commenting beyond their prepared statement.